Hi guys, today I'm going to do an introductory video on pivot charts in Microsoft Access. Okay, so I'm going to first show you the table that we're going to create the pivot chart off of. Okay, it's this customer financials table. Basically, this table, to give a real brief introduction to it, is the customer numbers, their names, their date of birth, their salaries, whether they're female or not, and the state in which they reside. Okay, so a nice a uh, pivot chart perhaps from this data could be uh, bar graphs maybe of total salaries by state okay so we'd have three bars because we have three states here New York Connecticut and Texas and then for each bar it would be adding up the salaries in that state that's one bar chart and let's see if we could figure out another one which would also give us a, a, a nice example so we can do two Okay, another one might be creating a pie chart of, uh, say, salary again, because that's our real only real data field for uh, salary, total salary for each state. So we'll have three slices, but then we could maybe add a certain, an, an, another level of uh, uh, filter, and that would be for only females. Okay, let's say we have some products that we only are interested in uh, our female market. So we want to we want that representation. Okay, so let's go create these. We'll close this. We'll click once on the customer table. That'll help us out. We go to create pivot chart right here. Okay, let's click on that, and it's very similar to a pivot creating pivot table, except of course we're getting a chart out of this and not a a uh, table. Okay, so if you haven't seen that video, that will be really helpful in uh, understanding what's going on here. And if not, you should be able to follow along. Okay, so we click on this blank area and we get all the fields from the table that we just discussed, right? We're familiar with all these right here. Okay, now let's do the first ch uh, chart that we were talking about the bar chart. Okay, so let's grab our salary and we'll throw it most definitely in the drop data fields here okay so so it makes just one big uh, bar with adding up all the salaries because we haven't uh, split it up into we haven't told access how to split this up so we want to split it up by state so we're going to grab state and we'll throw state into this bottom area drop category field okay and you see instantly it split up the 350,000 into the three states and each bar represents the total for each state so we're pretty much done here the only tweak we might want to make is maybe label our axes which you can easily do by clicking on the axis title going to property sheet and here you go to format and title this axis salary you don't even have to leave this property tab you can click on the x-axis here and you can call and you can change that to state then you could close this you got you have other control if you want to change fonts and stuff and make it prettier but for our purposes we are complete here okay so that was really easy and really useful okay so how about if we wanted to add we only wanted to see females in these states. We can grab female, drop it in the top area, this filter area. Our chart doesn't change at all, except now if we wanted to, we could only look at females. And female field was a field that was a binary field, check, which you checked if the person was a female and you left blank if it wasn't. So true here means that this uh, th that the person is a female okay so we'll only check true click OK and see our chart our bars slightly adjusted because we're only looking at females okay so that's the first uh, pivot chart I wanted to create let's see if we could create another chart actually I'm gonna do the second chart in a second video okay so I'm gonna label that one pivot charts lesson two okay so be sure to watch that okay I'll also link it right here in the top top uh, right hand corner you'll see a link for it okay so be sure to watch that
Okay, hope this was helpful. Please comment, subscribe to my channel, share these videos, and practice, practice, practice. Have a great day.